Hello guys, welcome to OSX86 Devs. Today, we want to bring you an easy tutorial on how to create a USB installer for High Sierra the easiest way possible. For this process, you don't need a Mac or a virtual machine, as we have modified this installer so it has Clover Bootloader already installed in it. What we need, an 8GB USB or bigger in size, the TransMac app, and the install Mac OS High Sierra DMG file. Let's start. First, plug your USB in your computer. Then, we're going to download install Mac OS High Sierra DMG file. To do so, go to the link in the description and open it in your browser. Then, just click download if you haven't used Mega V4, it's going to ask if you want to store files on this device, click allow. And then our download will begin. Once we have downloaded our files, you should see it here in download. Now we're going to download Transmac. Go to the link in the description for the Transmac website. And now in here where it says download Transmac as zip or executable, we're going to download it as executable. So click on the second option that says tmsetup.exe. This will download a free evaluation copy of the app that we can use for 15 days. But for us, it's enough as we will use it only once. Now remember, if you find the software useful, then don't forget to support the developers. Now that we have downloaded the install Mac OS High Sierra DMG file in the Transmac app, we have to install Transmac. So go to your downloads folder and click on TM Setup. It will ask for administrative permissions, so click yes. Now that the installer is open, click next and check the first option, which is I accept the agreement and click next. Now you can select where you want to install Transmac. If you want to install on the default folder, then just click on next. Now it will create a shortcut for the start menu. So click next. Now we want to have a shortcut in the desktop as well for easy access. And also, we want Transmac to associate our DMG files, so leave both options checked and click Next. Now just click Install. And when it finishes, uncheck both options and click Finish. Now we can see that the Transmac shortcut has been created in the desktop. So right click on it and click on Run as Administrator. It will ask for administrative permissions, so click yes. Now we have to wait 10 seconds. Then it will tell us to press run to continue our 15 days trial. So click run. Now we have to select our USB device from the devices list in the left. So right click on your USB and click the third option. Restore with disk image. If you see this warning message, just click yes. It's basically telling you that it will format your USB and all volumes on that same device. So make sure that you don't have important data in it or you will lose it. Now click on this button that has three dots and it will open a window for you to select the file from where you saved it. Unless you have an already established location from where to save files or you manually saved it in a different location, then it should be in downloads. So go to the folder where you downloaded the file, in my case is downloads, select it and click on open. As you can see, it says disk image to restore, install Mac OS High Sierra. Now click OK and you will get this message that's basically telling you again that it will format your USB and all data in it will be lost. So make sure you don't have any important data in it, otherwise back it up or you will lose it. So let's click yes. 
Now we have to wait for the restoring process to finish. Once the restore process is complete, just click OK. Now that the restore process is complete, just click OK and close Transmac. Well, there you go, guys. You have now a USB installer that you can use on any computer that's supported and has an Intel processor. That's it for today, guys. Remember, if you like our content, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest videos. Thank you and bye-bye.